guys, well, welcome to a slightly different law enforcement episode today with uh, Kate Riley. We're off duty. It's our uh, day off here in Polito Bay, and we've got some errands to run. So, we're going to be popping to the hair salon for a bit of a trim, and uh, off to the bank to deposit our check, and then we've got some errands to run at the drugstore and pop via the, uh, the grocery place. So, you know, it's going to be hopefully pretty mundane life here in Polito Bay. I think some of the civs have got businesses open, so we're going to do our thing, and I'm going to beach my El Camino. See if I can actually drive in a straight line, that'd be a good start. So yeah, uh, once again up in Polito Bay. It's kind of my favourite place, so you know what? At least it's not freaking Sandy Shores. Uh, which... Even we have a minor issue with overpopulation in this place. Heading up to uh, haircuts up here. We're gonna find a parking spot actually. Hey, yo, motherfucker. You still Where can I park? Can I park over there on the side of the road? No, there's an alleyway over there. I'll park in. Not my problem today. They can do whatever traffic violations they want. I don't have to care. Wait till we get a green, then we'll park it up across the road and we should be good. Dum -da -dum -da -dum. Come on, traffic lights. Yeah, so that house, that's that's Kate's place. Um, lived there her entire time in Plato Bay since she got here from where she used to live with her family in Tierra Rabada, north of San Fierro. Oh, this will do. Oh, that's a nice car. <sighs> nice relaxing day here in Plito. Jane, let me just take the barber cloth off. Oh, customer in there already, yeah. apparently. Oh, the bank. Perfect for my paycheck. I'll drop that one off next. All right, you can come uh, right over to the register and I'll ring you up. That will be, um, how much will it be? Okay, so that was just a trim. That'll just be 15 bucks. I'm busy in here today. I wasn't expecting this. Here's 20. You can keep the change. Yeah, thank you very much. Always tip. Uh, have a great night. Guess you have another customer, so see you later. All right, you too. Give us a call in case you need, uh, you know, some updating. Well, hey there. Okay, I... ma'am, how can I help you today? I called on the phone about an appointment. I just want some bit of a trim and just recolor. Okay, uh, what color are we thinking today? Just a touch up of the roots. All right, if you just uh, take a seat in one of the chairs, I'll be right with you when I get my tools ready. I don't know if I could sit down. <laughs> um, find out. Yeah. There we go. See if any of the seating animations work or will be appropriate. They probably will look ridiculous, but we're going to try them. Nope. You know what? We'll, we'll just sit over here. This will look appropriate, I promise. <laughs> I don't know how to sit in the chair. I don't think I actually can. Wow, she's actually got the animation sorted for washing your hands and tools and things. That's pretty amazing. <laughs> I'll sit here. Busy today then? Uh, well, this is my first time actually open 
been up, so you're my second customer. Oh, new in town? Yep, just moved in. Yeah, I saw the new sign up on the place and figured I'd come by and check it out. The old one was, and it was alright, but I used to go down to, down to the city to get things done. Okay, I'm just going to wrap this barber cloth around you so we don't get any uh, mess on your clothes. Thank you. Oh, it's been pretty quiet in town. And the way I like it. Yeah, it's, uh, it's real quiet up in Polito. I prefer it up here. Yeah, I moved here from... San Fierro. Wow, just north of there out in the desert, Tierra Bada. A lot cooler down here than it was up there. San Fierro, I've never been up there. That's pretty nice. I'm pretty smoggy, but up in the desert it was always very dry. I'm uh well I guess I might as well introduce myself. I mean, if you're new in town, I'm Kate. I'm one of the local cops actually. Oh, Kate. I'm Maya. I, uh, I came from Vice City all the way from, uh, over that way. Oh, wow. Lovely. Beautiful weather down there. What made you move all the way up here into this little town? Uh, I needed to change the scenery. You know, somebody had an opportunity for me out here, so I had to just, uh, take it. You sound uncertain. And I'm not uncertain, yeah. It was kind of a uh, had no choice type of opportunity. I see. I see. I'm sure you're pretty reluctant to tell me now. I've just told you I'm a local cop. Uh, well, no, no, not, <laughs> not really. Hey, new place, new start is my rule, okay? As long as nothing happens in my town, I'm. I can look any other way than the straight out things. Oh yeah, yeah. I haven't committed committed any crimes or anything. Good. I mean, our jails aren't as comfy as these chairs. You a Los Santos Panic fan? Uh, you know, I'm not really uh too much to the sports but oh i saw I'm some of the flags up in the it. store you just going for the local uh, you decor know, you gotta stay yeah you gotta stay good with the locals you know oh yeah yeah they're pretty uh pretty partisan up here if you're not one you're the other and if you're neither then you get funny looks i had to acquire a team to fit in oh yeah don't definitely don't want my shop to be egged by uh People that think I'm against the uh, panic. Oh, don't worry about it. There's only a couple of kids that do that sort of stuff, and uh, they mostly stick to working important things like the police station or the bank or sometimes even the hen house. That generally gets vomit, though, not eggs, but different group of customers. Well, hopefully that uh, never happens. Mm. See, you put some right, security I'm bars that we could send. Just gonna... uh, wait, could you say that again? I said, I see you put some security bars in a window. Are you concerned or? Uh, well, they were actually here by the previous owner, but I did get them reinforced, you know? The previous owner did say that he uh, had a little bit of trouble with hooligans of this town from time uh, to time you are opposite sure the hen why, house it's kind of the only reinforced. you are opposite the hen house it's kind of the only night spot in this place don't worry about things honestly we normally patrol the main drag during the evenings oh yeah it's definitely good to be right down the street from the uh station yeah it certainly is yeah well, i'll have to send uh some of the other officers your way you have a great service and a lovely place here yeah, I did get visited by uh, one officer. He asked me if I'll still be open uh, after his shift. And, uh, you know, it's our grand opening, so 
will be open 24 7. wow dedication i must say most of the officers don't have quite as much hair as i do but you know i'm sure you can make an effort on polishing their skills <laughs> yeah we we give uh hot shaves as well so they'll be good oh, i'm sure they're good for that almost like being bored of uniform in that place Most definitely. Okay, so um, I think we are almost done here. Awesome. Why don't you take a look and uh, tell me what you think so far? Oh, I'm liking it. Color's a lot richer now. Do you sit me with the highlights? Oh, yeah. We use uh, mostly natural uh, organic stuff, so there's not really heavy chemicals in the dye. That looks amazing. I love it. Oh wow! So, awesome. Uh, How much do I? Just, um, oh, let me just take this barber oh, okay. cloth off. Yeah. Of <laughs> Nearly forgot about that. Oh, thank you. All right, and now I come up to the register. Oh. Now bring you up. Yeah. Okay, so that was a trim and a little touch up on the roots. This, uh -huh. is, this is the grand opening. Uh, we're doing 50% off of regular stuff, so that'll just be 20 bucks. Okay, well, here's 20 and here's an extra five. Oh, thank you very much. Ain't no problem. Great service and deserves reward. We'll look after our own in our well, thank town. Thank you. If, uh, if you can get the word out, you know, to spread oh, the word for sure. to get more people coming here, that'd be thankful. I will tell everybody I see to head down this way. Have a great day. Okay, you too, Kate. She was lovely. Nice addition to the town. Slightly sketchy on her background details, so who knows? We might run into her, in, or at least might run into her past at some point. Right, so what did I say I had to go and do next? Uh, bank for my check, groceries, and a drugstore. The job the drugstore's in the grocery here, so. We will do the bank next. Get this thing sorted. Ah. Day of menial duties and things to sort out. God, the mountains look gorgeous from here. Oh, I love this picador. Looks pretty stock, but lovely car. Oh, there's the lights. Putting a goose in the engine and wasn't even thinking about anything else. Alright, I think it's bank time. Wow. Hooligans, huh? They look like they're out of town. Oh, there's some of the boys. <sighs> Let's sort this check out. Evening, ma'am. Evening. Good evening. Hello, ma'am. How hey can there. I help you today? Okay, so I've got my uh, paycheck here. I'd like to pop this into my account. Just stick it in the little uh, thing that goes under the window and... I'll see what I can do. And what account would you like to put this in? That's uh four three two seven eight nine seven six. It's uh Kate Riley. Alright. Alright, let me get that up right here. The hell? Hi there, ma'am. Just one quick question. How much was the check? Everyone get on the ground! Oh my god! What the- Get on! Get your hands up! Right, ma'am, you get your hands up! You tell her you get your hands up! Heck, give me all the money! Alright, alright, alright. My hands down so I can movement. go grab it? Give me all the money! Put it on the oh back! Oh my god. Alright, alright, alright! Do it now! Grab it. Keep those Don't hands up! Don't you dare touch 
that Don't button, you move. sir. You understand? We got oh. 20 seconds. Yeah, put all the money in here. Yep, I got. I drop the weapon. There's drop the it. There's the money. There, there it is. Oh. Yep. Don't. Drop it. Drop it now. Drop it now. Drop it. Drop it. Drop it. Hands. Show me hands. Show me your freaking hands now. Wall. Hands on the wall. Hey, security guy, put your hands down. I'm a cop. Hands on the wall. Can, can I ask for Can I come cop. out? Oh, cop. This cop's outside. Go ahead and come out, sir. You keep your hands on the damn wall. Okay. Need to put my hands clear 40, sight. 4032, this individual in the suit, pull him. Right here? Yep, go ahead and come out, sir. I'm just a bank teller. Oh, this got 32, pull him to your vehicle. All right, come over here. All right, keep going. I'm really nervous. Don't worry, sir. It's all fine. Just do what the officers outside tell you. It'll right, be over fine. Here a little more. Okay. All right. I'm going to okay. stop. All right. Officer. Look my vehicle. Go ahead, go ahead and uh, just take a step back for me, sir. Yeah. Officer? Yes, ma'am. Name's, name's Kate hey, Riley, off-duty, Polito PD, 4511. 4511. You got yeah. ID? Just stay here. Yep, I'm going to put the weapon on the ground. All right. I'm going to slide you my badge, okay? Yep, go ahead. All right. Uh, go ahead and pick your weapon back up. You can help me out with this situation then. Got it. Got one here. I put one's down over there. Not sure in his status, but we got one here. Dropped his firearm. We have him. You got cuffs? Yeah, here, take him off my belt and cuff him up. I'll hold got on. Got it. Thank you. Okay. Who is this? You in the mask. Speak. What's your name? You are crazy. You don't okay, need to know so my name. Okay, him. Gotta do. Oh my okay, God, I'm really you. Right now. I'm really, really nervous. Don't worry about it, sir. Don't worry. Okay, I've got him. Do you want to check the guy that's down? That? Sir, you work here? Yeah, I'm uh, part of security here. All right, there's a, an officer got... outside. Okay, Go ahead and meet you can with, with me. I'm gonna advise him you're coming out. Stand by yep. one second. Stay in front of me. Come on. What's the status on the one over there? Uh, I think you got him up pretty good, officer. Good. Okay, you face that cruiser. Face the hood. Okay, I'm going to search you this time. Anything on you that's going to poke me, probably stick me or hurt me anyway? I ain't got nothing. I dropped everything. Damn straight you did. Okay, I'm going to frisk you at this time. Actually, I'll step over here. Do I find anything? Alright, go ahead and head outside, sir. I've advised him. Yeah, which officer? Okay. Uh, He's just to your left. You're gonna see a okay. squad car out there. Just to your left. Alright, thank you. Okay, I have to so, advise okay, you at this time. Good. You're under arrest for bank robbery. You have the right to remain silent. Anything you do say can and will be used Second. against you in a court of law. Sir, can you, you have you the right me? to attorney. If you can afford one, one provided for Ooh. you to defend his rights. Sir, get your hands, get your hands right. back up. Get your hands back up. Do not reach for anything. Wait, did you stay there for a second? In the back. Coming in. Sir, good, keep your hands where they're at. Do not reach. Got him covered. Do you want to go in and check? So you, right here. So do you, you must be here? wearing hella body armor. Yeah, I work here. All right. So can you explain I'm, what happened? I'm the. Well, I was behind the desk. I'm the bank teller, and these. I was helping this this lady over here, which I guess she's an undercover cop or something. Not quite undercover. And she was depositing a check, and I was in the process of depositing it into the computer and everything. And these two men ran in, and they're like, "Put your hands up." This we need is to sort the audio range or something like that. I can't fully remember. And 
you can probably guess what happened from then. <laughs> okay. Wow. Okay, I got I got a block. rifle and a gun off him. And yeah, I copy that. Uh, so uh, I work with security here for the bank. Um, see, saw these two uh, gentlemen pull up with that uh, sports. You have any vitals? Right there. Uh, came in, they shot, essentially told us to get yeah, on the ground, put our hands up, so on and so forth. Pulse, so I'm gonna go ahead and call um, medics in. I was able Happy, to kind him. of see I'll stay with him. Uh, what that female was doing. Uh, she then, uh, she pulled out a cunt, uh, or sorry, correction, she pulled out a gun when she was in a corner. Uh, advised oh, that they crap. were the truth of the officer. Oh, there we go. Uh, one turned on her, Music she audio. Uh, engaged him, and the other one started fleeing towards the back, which at that moment, uh, she had her at gunpoint. She told me to uh, take my hands down, so I went and uh, kicked away the gun from the other suspect. And, uh, All right, if you want to go help outside, just make sure that, that uh, everybody's clear out here. I yeah, got, got it. Covered. Thanks for the backup. Thanks for yeah, stepping yeah, no up. Worries. All right. Sir, can you hear me? I'm sure I wasn't lying down. Sir? Hey, you the medic? Stand by, sir. We got medics coming. Yes, ma'am. I'm the medic. Okay, there's oh, one inside, uh, gunshot wounds, uh, he's a uh, hostile though. He's secured by an officer, so you should be clear to go in. Alright, thank you. Hey. Hey. So, uh, yeah, I don't know what these guys have told you. The one in the black. What's that? I don't know what they've told you, but, um, yeah, be, I was... Advised, this individual here is, uh, he's, we he's need to sort this shot. radius. Okay, so right, sir, let's move over here. Uh, Alright, sir, my name is Vincent Lowe at the Blaine County Fire. Just a little peace and quiet. Um, okay, so I was depositing a check and I'd seen this vehicle outside before, the red one. It was burning out down the street. Um, I heard it again when I was inside the bank and pulls up outside, screech tires. Not the most subtle entry I've ever seen. And those two come charging in, face masks, body armor, old dolls, long rifles, and all the usual stick-up routine. I complied initially. Um, it's like a maneuver to a more advantageous location inside the bank. Uh, once I had the drop on them from behind, I threw my service weapon, issued a warning. One of them turned on me. I engaged him and dropped him. The other one dropped his weapon and complied, and your officers arrived on scene. Okay, alright. So, those two, the guy in the blue suit and the one in the black suit, they said they work here, so... Is that yeah, true, correct? Yeah, that's, uh, the black suit looked to be a security guard, fat you see was. Uh, blue suit was Teller. Oh, okay. All right, yeah, well, that security guard probably needs firing, out. he was terrible. <laughs> I just got here. Yeah. Hey, no worries. Right, well, hey, this is my day off. I mean, I thought I was going to do my groceries and drop off my check and go to the hair salon. I didn't think I was going to get involved in this crap. Yeah, well, not in Plato Bay, I guess. Yeah, never quite, is it? Uh, yeah, so I guess I'll wait till your, uh, your officer inside's done with things, but you got everything you need from me vis a vis uh, report? Yep, alright. You want to take this, by the way? It's my service weapon, but I've just discharged it and it'll probably be needed for the investigation. Okay, then. There you go, pop that in that evidence bag. I'll go wait for your boss, okay? Alright. Watch the road. Hey, man. You guys okay? Hey. Yeah, I just want to say thank you. Hey, we're good. Hey, no, it's my job. I'm a police officer in town, so seriously, don't sweat it. It's my job. Um, rather me than you guys, okay? Yeah. You okay? Yep, I just want to say thank you very much. Got a bit close. Like I said, it's not a problem. It's my job, okay? You guys are you sure you're okay, though, both of you? Yeah, I, I didn't get hit or anything. Good. I'm glad to hear it. I hope to give you guys uh, <laughs> I hope to give you guys a race for this. Just uh, it was a bit of a yeah. You did good, guys. You did exactly what you're meant to do. Just don't antagonize them. Don't draw their fire. I'm sure okay. 
Where's uh, Mr. C? Alright, you too old. Well, you to go, thanks. Alright, sir, I can actually get a finger in between yeah, these so they're not too right. tight. Thank you very they're, much. They're they're not meant for comfort, sir, so we advise that yep, that's no that's as loose as they're gonna get. Be safe. Those those handcuffs yeah, are not made for comfort yep. in any way, shape, or form. So I can get a finger inside there, that's all I need to be able to do. So it, You know, that, I walk over here and I hear saying. I can get a finger inside there. I'm not entirely are you, are you having the conversation I think you're having? Go ahead and hop back in, sir. You put the handcuffs too tight. He's advising the handcuffs are too tight, but I can get a finger in there. Damn so straight they were too tight. That was on purpose. Guy waves no, a gun at me when I'm doing my shopping. There. You know, I'm going to put them on nice and tight. I appreciate the help. And I yeah, also appreciate uh... <laughs> the fact that you, uh, you were able to properly identify yourself without me having to shoot you in. You took proper measures to make sure I didn't shoot you. Well, the second I saw you outside, I was hey, just hands up in the air out of the way. Um, oh, let's walk over here a little bit. That's exactly that's exactly how I would handle it, so I appreciate it. Yeah, absolutely. Um, I gave my uh, just my G2 weapon I had on me. Um, I gave it to your uh, officer by the car. Uh, so it's in an evidence okay. bag now for you guys because I discharged that. He's I'll fill in the paperwork secured. at the Excellent. station, but... Um, yeah. Excellent. I was. This is meant to be my day off. I was meant to be having, you know, nice relaxing day, going doing some errands, and this crap picks off. This count as overtime. Absolutely. I I appreciate your help 100%. <laughs> Obviously, that other individual, he's sent off to jail, so you you definitely know what you're doing. I appreciate your help out here. I I happen to be across the street and I happen to hear it, so that's how I got alerted to it. Yeah, I just hope I'd, I just wish I hadn't had to shoot the first guy, but he turned on me with a weapon and his buddy was there, so I, I had to neutralize one of them to deal with the other threat. Absolutely. I don't hate absolutely. doing it. I yeah, absolutely hate doing that. you want to go ahead that. and hit, hit that report for me? And, I will uh, do. Then I can, I can get this guy transported and uh, I'll get your stuff booked in and we'll try to get it processed. I'm on, uh, I'm on duty tomorrow gun. morning, so can I fill that out at the station when I come on duty? Yeah, yeah, if you need to, that's fine. Just as long yeah, as you I keep it fresh in your head, I, I got no problem with that. I already gave my statement to your uh, to your colleagues, so hopefully I'll I'll fill out my report. Excellent. First thing, so. Excellent. Okay. See you, Tony. All right. Thank you. Appreciate <laughs> it. All oh. right, Kyle. Hey. Did you uh, hopefully read my that check gentleman's right yet by chance? Uh, the one right there. That's in the back of my car. Yeah. Uh, no, I'll go do that. Oh, okay, it's excellent. okay. Hey. With the security guard. Tony, I read him his rights. He's all good. Yes, sir. You've already read him? Thank you. Yep, I did. Hey, officer. Alright, Chief. So, is there anything I else you need before around. I'm able to go? If I can get out of this parking lot in one piece. Alright, what do we got? Right, where's the. Uh... There we go. Willies. Well, just because I've had to intervene in a attempted bank robbery of all things doesn't mean I have an excuse not to go do the groceries. Otherwise, I'm eating ramen for next week. So, I've got to make sure I do the groceries and go to the pharmacy, get everything else sorted. But, you know what? It'll be pretty boring if I end up sitting here and doing grocery shopping with you guys. So, I guess we'll sign off for this one. Kate's day off was not quite as quiet as I would have liked. We will see you again guys. Thanks for watching. <laughs> that was far worse than I expected. I wasn't imagining a bank robbery of all things. I... Wow. Thanks for watching guys. Bye.